Hey guys, I'm fucking plugin reviews here. In this video, I'm just doing um a plugin review. There's the first one of the channel, so just leave a like for that. And yeah, let's get to it. Um, the first one is um bucket um is it um it's called um core protect actually yeah there it's a um, plugin for bucket. It's a one, it's currently a 1.4.7 plugin. And yeah, so let's get to it. Um, so first of all, um, this is, um, what you have to do first of all, um, actually one second, give me one second, sorry about that, okay, I'm back. Um, so you have to do, um, for the commands, it would be core protect dot asterisk, so let me write it out, core, pro okay, one second, core protect dot asterisk, like that, and then, um, for the help screen, you would do, Core protect protect dot help exactly like that for the permissions and yeah so um after you set that up I will just do dash co help and then I will bring up a five um six actually but the six one doesn't really have any point into it so it's pretty much five so first of all well, let's go into the first one which is inspect. So you, so the permission for that would be core protect dot inspect. So let me write that out. Core protect dot inspect. Hey, look that rhymes. <laughs> core protect dot inspect like that. And you would do dash c o inspect. And that will put you in inspector mode. And what you do in inspector mode is um when you um left click a block, it'll say who placed it, when it was placed, and, um, wait, it will say if it was placed, when it was placed, and who placed it. So, let's see here. Oh, it will say the block ID also. Placed by the block ID 1.3 hours ago, and all that stuff. No, it does not destroy the blocks, and, yeah. So, first of all, before you guys go all free, like, psycho, and ask me, Oh god, this does not work. You're the worst and all that stuff. Just look at this. You do dash co inspect one more time. It'll take you out of inspector mode. Now you can break blocks, see? So yeah, that was um, one thing that I wanted to tell you guys. So that was inspector mode. Um, pretty easy. Now we do dash co help. Let's see the other command. Okay, dash co rollback params so you do um first of all the permissions for rollback would be core protect dot rollback so let me write that out core protect dot rollback like that and then um it will allow you to access the rollback commands and um yeah so let's get to it dash co rollback oh my god ah rollback and then you would do T space T colon the your username or whoever's. And then you would do um after that after T oh wait no sorry very sorry about that do not do a T do you colon and then you would do username and after you do the username then you would do T um which is time so. Before we do T, I want to tell you one thing. T, um, you can do 2W, for example, would be two weeks. 5D would be five days ago. Um, seven hours. Um, 7H would be seven hours. 2M would be two minutes. And 10S would be ten seconds ago. So, yeah. So, let me do that. CO rollback. Um, U colon username. And then you would do T colon. Then on um, the time ago, I just put one day, for example. And after you do that, you would do B for blocks. And then, like, there is those blocks right in front of me. I'll just put, st I'll just take away the stone. So I'll just put one. And after you do that, you would do E colon, space E colon. I just put any block, pretty much. And then I'll just put R for radius, so I'll just put 10. It'll take away the stone. 
And yeah, I think that if you um, you can actually try and use this as a um, I don't know if you would be willing to do it, but probably it can be like um, a thing to build. Like you just build a certain little frame, and then it will do this design. New news world edit to fill this in and such. Just getting an idea. <laughs> So yeah, that was rollback. So dash co help. Um, once again, the, um, the permission for that would be corporatech dot rollback. Just so you guys know. And now the next one would be dash co roll dash co restore. So um, the permission for that would be corporatech dot restore. So let me do that. Corporatech dot restore. That be like that take that restore and then um you would do um after you do that you do dash co restore and i think this is the perfect case like i just took that and i would put a um username my um you colon your the name time let's put like 10 m and then um, I would put B, I will put the block 1. I think this is the best case I can show you it in. After I put B, I would put, uh, let's see, E. I'll just, uh, this exclude 3. And then radius, I'll just put 10. I think that will put it back. Actually, I'm not so sure about um, that. So, I think it will work if I get right under it. No, I'm actually not too sure about um this one, but I'm all sure about the other one. So sorry because I don't, I, I didn't get restore too much. So yeah, I think it's supposed to like restore some some blocks that broke and such. So once again, the thing for that would be corporate tech dot restore their permission. And yeah, let's see dash co help. And after um restore would be dash co lookup. And now um, I can um, look up blocks who placed them. So okay, let's see. I'll do what? No, I should do glowstone. It would you um, the permission for this would be core protect dot lookup. So core protect dot lookup. Once again, core protect dot lookup. And then um, after that, you would do um, dash co lookup. And it's the same thing like rollback and um, restore, like you, you username, time, block, exclude, and um, what else was it? And uh, let's see, oh yeah, radius. So you would do this, um, you for your username and such, T for time, just put one day, just one H actually, no, no, no. 2H here. There we go. <laughs> then you would do B for blocks. I would put five like that's wooden planks over there. And then um, after I would do this, I would just do exclude four. Uh, I'll just put any block. Then I'll put R. Do I might there are any blocks from it? So I'll just put that. Oh wait, actually, I'm a bit far from that. I guess two sixty. Yeah, I'll probably reach it. There we are. Right here. And then it says that I missed one. Like one got um hit. So and if I do that again, if I uh, just take some out and I look them up again, it'll say a few of them got got missed out. Let's see if I do it again. Oh yeah, it's gonna show the same thing. And also I would do um dash C O L of L and then it would you would do page one this was page one and such so yeah that was um lookup let's see what else um once again the permission for that was cor core protect dot lookup now what else is co purge dash c o purge and the permission for purge would be um core protect dot purge like that. Once again, core protect that purge. And then um for that you would do dash co purge. And as you can see it says 
that's the old purge months I would put like one like so but it would search that but like this is just um, a plugin review server and I've only um had it for like for like few hours it's not going to search anything from months ago because it's just generated and yeah so um let's see what else there is yeah there's probably just some um, the version of it and the last one here like not really so important you would do dash co version which requires no permission at all and it will say running on corporate tech whatever version you're watching this at using file based data storage website corporate tech.net and then sponsored by hosthor.com which i believe should be some sort of server hosting company and yeah hope you guys enjoyed um this video um if you like the video just remember to leave a like helps me out a lot and um yeah if you guys have any questions for me or um, anything like that leave a comment in the comment section down below or either you can just um private message me but i think it would be better in the comments down below because other people can help you because if i don't know the answer you'll be screwed so um you can always ask the people in the comment section down below because they should know and yeah guys um once again hope you guys enjoyed um this was corporate tech i'll put links to first of all i'll put links to more than one thing just so you guys if you guys need any extra information i'll put links to the how to, where to get craft bucket um also i'll put a link to uh what's it called um the um plugin itself corporate tech i'll also put a link to corporate text commands i'll also put a link to corporate text on permission um like things also i'll put um, a link to its um compatible third-party plugins and tools and finally i'll put a link to um it's uh what's it called what's it called uh, um what was it api documentation so yeah that that i'm gonna put links to all those things yeah so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video i am um bucket plugin reviews signing out